on the reel here and Sweet Week event is on. So let's get into it. Um, I am going to skip the tutorial and I'm going to start. This is your basic restaurant uh, style game. So you can blend the strawberries. You can make coffee and then you have your bread. Obviously right now it starts us out with just a little bit just to get the hang of it. But as you progress, the levels get harder. I can actually put two strawberries. I'm do that. Make it go faster. So at the moment, everything's taking forever because you will see that we will be able to get power ups to make things go faster. Okay. That's the basic gist of the game. So it says right here tap the button to replenish your supplies. So see how now we have more items we're working with? Okay, this one wants a little wafer thing on top. You ran out of ingredients. Tap the button and wait a few seconds to replenish them. You gotta be careful here because if you tap that one town buck, it'll automatically spend it. So it's kind of... You just gotta tap it once, you gotta be careful. Like that? Mama, like that? Okay. <laughs> Alright, perfect. Okay, waiting for my. Come on, my bread. There we go. And it doesn't matter what order you set up the cake in, it'll always come out, you know, the same. All right, so let's go over the personal event goals. We have the first goal, you get three town bucks. And with that, you unlock the leaderboard, I believe. And then you got all these other ones here. And at the very last one, you get a decoration which looks like a robot serving people, which is really cute. And then this profile picture, which is like a mouse or something with the cake. Okay. Here is your upgrade area where you can upgrade the kitchen. So it's telling me to do the coffee first. So I'm just gonna click on that for now, but you have all these different kinds of, you know, it doesn't matter what order you do them in. Eventually, if you play enough, you can get them all, all the way maxed out. And then the ingredient ones is to have more of a certain ingredient so you don't run out and have to refill it because refilling takes time. So let's do, I'm going to do the strawberries since we used that for on top of the cake and for the frosting. All right, so let's play another level. Now we got kiwis added to the mix. And since we're only working with kiwis and strawberries right now, I'm gonna have one of each in the blender. So I do like that. So doing it this way makes everything a lot smoother. And then as you can see, it also gives you tips. It says right here, treat customers to lollipops so they're more patient waiting for their orders. And that's like when you get down to the harder levels, that will be helpful. All right, first goal unlocked. We can become the best pastry shop in town. Let's participate in the local tournament. Fill as many orders as you can, earn better prizes in the competition. So the leaderboard prizes are different from your personal event prizes. So if you're first on the leaderboard, you get 55 town bucks and a free town expansion. Then you got second, third, which gets 33, and then you get a lab booster, which is the train booster. And then after that, you got fourth through seven. Not too good there. And then everything else really is not great, but you know, it's okay. Did you run out of supplies? Don't worry, you can always make some more at Pamela's factory located opposite the event calendar. Okay, let's head over to the factory. That's right here. And here you fill in these orders to get more supplies. And the supplies 
are the little baggy things that you get to play the game. See how we only have three, so we can't play another game yet. So I'm gonna upgrade the kitchen, see what I can do. Um, I think I'm gonna go with the wafers. Really doesn't matter. Oh, I sh oh no, I didn't have enough to get kiwis. Okay. So then, along with that, we also have decorations, which is like my favorite part, <laughs> as you know. We have a town day, what? Town day town sign, <laughs> which is new. We have a gingerbread fence. Ooh, okay, wait, let's start here first. Cause we got a lot going on here. Gingerbread gate, Jolly Painters, Chocolate Mill, the Candy Carousel, and we already went over the sign, Outdoor Cinema, and the Robot Cafe, which you can get if you complete all your personal event goals, but if you can't, you can also buy it here with Town Cash. So my favorites that I'm looking at here is this gingerbread fence and the gate. I mean, there's so much you can do with that. And I have a, like a little sweet area right over here in my town where I think if I made it a little bigger, I could expand it and make it look super cute. But I don't know, we'll see. I don't know if I have enough room for all that. I'm gonna have to take out some roads and stuff. Plus, this is also kind of like Christmas mixed, Christmas themed, as you can see over here. So I guess I have to think about that one. But that's so cute, you guys. And then, let's see if we have any special ing like uh, ingredients, special recipes for this event. I don't see any so far. But let me double check, because you know we always check. I don't see anything. I already clicked on that. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like there's any special recipes. So, oh, nope. Chef's hat. Okay, we got the chef's hat. What else do we have? That can't be it. Did I skip a factory? No. Don't tell me it's just that. What? Oh, here we go. A cookbook. Okay. Oh, a tablecloth. So, chef's hat, cookbook, tablecloth. I believe that's it. Yeah, I don't see anything else. If I missed it, let me know in the comments. But I don't see anything else. So yeah, that's the event, you guys. I hope you guys uh, enjoy this event. It's not too hard, so this should be fun. And I will see you guys in the next video. Okay, bye!